This is a wonderful and awe-inspiring stone monument, undoubtedly the most famous prehistoric site in Scotland. It stands on a rise and is visible from a wide area around, particularly when picked out by the shifting rays of sunlight through the broken cloud of a Lewis summer sky. Visitor numbers are now such that a path has been laid around the perimeter of the site by Historic Scotland to lessen the damage to the interior of the avenue and circle. Callanish has now become a focus again for visits at the summer solstice by those perhaps hoping to see the Shining One who, according to local legend, walks up the avenue on the midsummer dawn. These visits are the continuation of a Lewis tradition carried on in spite of the church's opposition. The stones of Lewisian gneiss were buried in peat up to about six feet before they were cleared in the year 1857. There are several elements to the site. A ring of large stones about 12 meters in diameter encloses a huge monolith at its center. Also in the middle of the ring are the remains of a chambered cairn revealed when the peat was cut away. As the cairn appears to have been added to the circle and chambered cairns are often considered to be Neolithic in date, it seems clear that the site in general is also Neolithic. <laughs>